Hello students, once again welcome to Bholanath Academy. In rotational dynamic students, now we are going to see the state and prove the principle or law of conservation of angular momentum. Now, this is the last part of the chapter students, the state and prove the principle or law of conservation of angular momentum. Angular momentum of body is conserved if the resultant external torque on the body is what? Zero. Then we can say angular momentum is what? Conserved. The angular momentum of body is conserved if the resultant external torque on the body is zero. Consider a moving particle of mass small m whose position vector with the respect to the origin at any instant is what? R bar. The linear velocity of this particle is given by V bar equals to dr bar upon dt. Its linear momentum will be P bar equals to m V bar. Understanding students? Its angular momentum about an axis through the origin is given by L bar equals to R bar cross B bar. Understanding? The time rate, the time rate of change of its angular momentum, if you are going to differentiate this expression, students, L bar equals to R bar cross B bar. We are going to differentiate with respect to time. So D upon dt of L bar equals to D upon dt of R bar cross P bar. Now this is expression U into V form. Understanding, students? So R bar as it is, we are going to differentiate P p bar that is t d p bar upon dt plus now it means second terms as it is we are going to differentiate first dr bar upon dt understand it means dp bar upon dt is nothing but it means force understanding plus dr upon dt is nothing but velocity of the particles understanding now what happens means that means dl bar upon dt bar dl bar upon dt bar is nothing but r bar cross p bar plus v bar now instead of that we can write p bar you can write m v bar now what happens students because here students when you find out the v bar cross v bar that is equal to zero so whole terms will become zero understanding students so you are getting dl bar upon dt bar is nothing but r bar cross f bar which is nothing but torque which is equal to what torque so hence if torque is what if hence if torque is zero dl bar upon dt is also equals to zero this prove the principle of conservation of angular momentum understanding students so these are coming for two marks questions students how you are going to prove it is very important for the examination point of view if you like my video please share it subscribe it thank you thank you very much god bless you